Hi, welcome back to Healthy Cooking with Z. Today, we're gonna to be making a slow cooker pizza casserole. Our recipe calls for coarsely chopped cauliflower. I like using my Xylos chopper. Um, you're gonna have some freshly grated or just shaved Parmesan cheese. We're gonna have some low-fat mozzarella. I have this pizza blend, it's what's here, so we're gonna use it. You're gonna have turkey pepperoni, and then some seasonings, garlic, salt, first the ground pepper, oregano, basil, and I went ahead and measured those first three out. They're gonna have marinara sauce, and your goal with this to have it healthy is to have it be five carbs or less per serving. Um, this one's just slightly high. It's got 15 carbs, but the serving on this is a half of a cup, and we're counting a serving as a quarter of a cup. So a quarter cup should have five carbs or less, and uh, so this is just like seven and a half. And then we're gonna have a pound of lean ground turkey or ground beef. This is turkey. I went ahead and browned it up. To our ground ground beef or turkey, we're gonna add our garlic powder, the black pepper, and our salt, and just mix that up a little bit. And if you do have fat in there, go ahead and drain that off. This was lean enough that this was quick dry. There's nothing here to drain off. Then into our browned and drained ground beef or ground turkey, we are going to add our basil and oregano. And we're gonna put in the chopped cauliflower. Did you say cauliflower or cauliflower? Hmm. And then we're gonna put in the freshly grated Parmesan cheese. I just love Parmesan cheese. It's low in the fat, but it gets a lot of flavor for just a little bit there. And then our two cups of the marinara sauce. Okay, I'm just gonna blend this all up till it's evenly distributed. And then of course we have to add in, we get to add in our two ounces of the pepperoni. And this has been cut into quarter pieces, so it's got little pieces, so it'll help you get little bites of that as you're eating. Then you're gonna take your slow cooker and spray it so that it won't stick. And we're gonna put the mixture that we just created into this pan and then we're going to put it in our slow cooker and it's going to cook on low for four to six hours and you're going to feel like you're living in an italian kitchen coming up on our three and a half hours it's looking good and it's smelling delicious Right, so I'm just now coming back to this, and it has been just about five hours. And yes, it smells delicious, and you can see how nice and thick it is. Just stir it up here just a little bit. And now, we're gonna top this with the shredded cheese, the mozzarella cheese. So put that all over the top. And then we're gonna add an ounce of the turkey pepperoni. So that's gonna be here on top. And that's kind of the finishing touch. And then we're gonna to continue to uh, put the lid back on and cook this in the slow cooker on high now for the next 30 minutes. I'm going to come back and see how nice and melted down this is. Happy cooking. All right, our 30 minutes are up. And here we have the finished product. Oh, yum. You see how melty that is? It's beautiful. Anyway, I'm gonna dish some of this up and we'll give it a try. Day of healthy cooking is complete and we have a wonderful dinner ready. The slow cooker pizza casserole is yummy and delicious. And I would never have guessed that it has this much cauliflower in it. So if you have those friends or family members you wanna eat a little bit more veggies, this is a good one to try. Thanks so much for joining me today on Healthy Cooking with Z.